Welcome back everyone, this is Dirch and I've got another Aurelia build for you and this time it is the Company Man. I know this is uh, not exactly a hard thing to pull off, but uh, I haven't played with the Company Man for a long time and uh, I was watching this weekend uh, Cold Treats, Karma, uh, Tweety and Princess Raptor do some pre-sequel stuff and I just wanted to play with the Company Man, so... Uh, yeah, so here's a really a company man, and I wanted to do it a little bit differently, so I was looking through some comms, and the privileged upper class com looked uh, kind of fun to me. Fire rate and reload go great with Hyperion shotguns, and culling the herd and frigid touch are two good skills for it. Um, frigid touch gives me an insane amount of lifesteal, and this is pretty definitely overkill lifesteal. I could have spread some points out, but I was fine with it. And culling the herd is a big damage boost, and I'm going to be scoring critical hits, so I'm going to have pretty much always on 66% gun damage from the skill, which is pretty damn solid, um, especially combined with all of her other stuff, you know, your large caliber, your critical hit damage here, um, critical hit here, Gun damage and fire right there. More gun damage and reload speed here. And, you know, my accuracy will start stacking up as I kill a lot of things. So this should be a pretty fun uh, way to play with Aurelia and it should work really well. Yes, there are probably some better DPS comms like the Ultra... Ultra High Definition is always insanely good. I've got like 8 billion comms on her. Um, Where is that? This is pretty much... You know, a hard to beat com, but I always use it, so I wanted to switch it up. And uh, that's why I wanted this one instead. So, uh, yeah, let's uh, kill some scavs. And, uh, yeah, this thing uh, wrecks. No surprise, the reload's insanely fast. I just love her, really. There's so many ways to make her awesome. She can just... She can use so many things. She's so versatile. Hope that's not uh, wrecking my... Uh... My uh, stacks there. Company man, it's just, I mean, Hyperion shotguns, we all know how awesome they are. And this is kind of like the flare of Hyperion shotguns. Whoa, my, uh. Oh, there he is. My life still didn't seem to be kicking in there like it should have, but, uh, it's fine. sustain fire from these and yeah she lowers the mag with a uh, large caliber but it doesn't matter you can see calling the herd just doesn't really go away oh he died too fast and they're all dead that just absolutely destroyed everyone so you can see, even without the uh, ultra-high definition comm, she just absolutely destroys everything. I'm going to uh, go for some long-distance shooting on these guys. Why am I not critting them? I guess there's some RNG there. Oh, I don't think I have long-range killer on. And I might as well shard it to get that bonus damage. Alright, now they're going to be out of my way. One more. Do you not go that far? And got some good avalanche stacks there. I'm going to go grab a vehicle and... Or do I go over to the Felicity map? Yeah, I'll go over there. That's always a good map. 
see how the oh I should probably grab some ammo because I used a lot all right And where's the badass? He's dead. I love when the shard just gets so much uh, avalanche and stuff too, it just wrecks people. I mean, there's a nice one shot. Not like fire dots. Need to find out who did that to me. Oh. And stomps. Did that guy just kill himself by stomping me? He had the fire gun. And him. And yeah, everyone died just stupidly fast because uh, really is stupidly powerful. Got those short summer stacks really flying. Avalanche is building up. Accuracy is building up. So it's just getting more powerful as you go. And stay away from the fire barrels. Yeah, god, this gun is so good. Oh, I don't see those guys in here that often. And you get the double healing again. This is crit. Where is that fire? Looks like he had a splitter. God, I love splitters. I should do a splitter build with her. Oh, these guys are just frozen. <laughs> Did that guy even, like, come out alive? Are you? And shattered. God, this thing is stupidly powerful. And I'm not even using like the optimal com for it. <laughs> oh god, you gotta love it. Uh, ammo quick. All right. Let's see how I do against our good old friend over here. She'll have bullet reflection up at first, which always sucks. So I can't take advantage of all the good crits. Did she drop it? Yep. Oh shit. Fuck, I didn't have a crit up. Or a kill skill up. What the hell? Why am I not shooting those turrets? What the fuck? Did I kill that turret? Uh, that was weird. I was aiming right at the turrets and it didn't work. So that sucks. And I lose all three things. Cool. Holy shit, I just ran through those two maps in like no time. Yep, and I lose everything! Why was I not hitting those turrets? Were they dead? No. Well, they shouldn't have been. There's no way I killed all three of those turrets. That was glitchy as fuck. Alright. What the fuck's going on? She is glitchy as hell. Alright. And the drone's like inside or something? Whoa! Alright, there's some kill skills.
gotta get my kill skills back. Gotta keep that uh, life steal up. Oh shit. That's not good. <laughs> Alright, ammo run. There's a bunch of ammo boxes, so that's the good news. Oh, and shield up, so more ammo. Drop it. Do I got anything else to kill? Nope. Transfusions. Come on, transfusions. Come find me. I know I'm like running away from them. There we go. Did you drop your fucking shield already? I'll just finish her with this then. And finished. All right. So that's uh, Company Man Aurelia. I had that one weird uh, somehow died to her turrets not being there to shoot, even though they should have been. And just me being sloppy. Let's see what I get here. And anything cool. Not really too cool. One of these days, I uh, I have not started the DLC with this character, the Claptrap. So one of these days, I'll do an Aurelia Claptrap playthrough. But uh, yeah, this is the Company Manor with Aurelia, a gun that I love. Hyperion shotguns are awesome. It's almost, well, it's not Butcher-esque, but it feels almost Butcher-esque just the way it, the way it works and everything. Uh, this game obviously doesn't have the Butcher, but this gun is sweet, it's fun, and the Claptrap DLC was full of so many good guns. Um, yeah, they really nailed it with that one. So, yeah, if there's any other guns you guys uh, want me to use as Aurelia, um, I was thinking of doing, like, the Party Popper. Ooh, I really like Juggernauts. But uh, my backpack's full. Um, yeah, just let me know. I'm always, uh, just have fun doing different setups with her and different builds with her. Like I said, this one really wasn't a challenge at all. This was kind of a face rolling gun, but, you know, it's a different com than usual. Haven't ran with this gun in a really long time, and sometimes you just want to play with some fun things, because, uh, pre-sequel's a pretty awesome game. So, yeah, that's all I've got for you guys right now. Thanks for watching, as always. I appreciate it. Uh, if you guys have not yet subscribed, please do so. Uh, follow me on Twitter, Twitch, Facebook, and recently the Discord group I'm running has merged with the Facebook group. Um, so those of you that are part of the Borderlands Complete Picture Facebook group, uh, you can come on and join the Discord. There's a lot of people in there, and it's kind of an extension of it now. Um, so I've kind of de de my uh, the Discord, and it's just gearbox discord so uh yeah come uh come over there uh that's all i've got for you so thanks for watching i'll see you all later bye